city of Fountain grows. City leaders say the cost and job of repairing its crumbling streets has simply become too much. Now the leaders are poised to ask voters for more money. In continuing coverage, KRDO News Channel 13 Scott Harrison explains why the city wants to be the seventh member of the Pikes Peak Rural Transportation Authority. Fountain officials would like to do more street repaving similar to this job that was just recently done in the downtown area. And they're hoping to convince voters that a one cent sales tax increase would fund more street repaving like this and also rebuild some of the worst streets. That would happen this fall if voters approve Fountain becoming a member of the PPRTA. For the past 20 years, its members have paid a penny sales tax for local transportation projects. And for Fountain, the time to join is now. We have several other neighborhoods where the majority of those neighborhoods, the roads were put directly on clay. So we are gonna have to come in and dig them out and build it from the base up, which this is a great example of. In this area, the city is getting some help. The developer of a housing project is paying to rebuild two roads to that higher standard, something that Evan says wasn't always done by some past developers. Fountain City leaders say that as a member of the PPRTA, they would get more revenue from their existing local sales tax than they currently do, simply because they haven't been a PPRTA member. And that's the beauty of it for the city and for drivers in the future. In Fountain, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13.